everybody, this is Karma. She is a, a gorgeous Border Collie Australian Shepherd mix. And she's chocolate with white with really beautiful curly hair. Um, she's a very sweet dog, likes to meet all kinds of people, um, gets along great with people. She, uh, you know, you can introduce her to anybody and she's happy to meet them. Um, sometimes she doesn't like the bossier dogs, but she usually you learn to tolerate them um, once they've spent some time getting to know each other. Um, we would like it if you were interested in adopting Karma to research the breed just a little bit, you know, go online and look up Border Collies and Australian Shepherds. Um, they're really special dogs, one of the most intelligent dogs you'll ever find. Um, Karma's very smart, she knows all kinds of tricks, she's house trained, um, you know, really a very nice dog. and She calms down once she's had her exercise and stuff, um, but it would be best if you Research the breed so you know what you are um, adding to your family. Uh, you know, Karma has a little bit higher energy level, even though she's five. Um, she also has those breeding in, or herding instincts, um, so she does want to move things with her nose. Um, and because of that, we are recommending no small children because she likes to move things with her nose and sometimes her teeth. Um, she's never hurt anybody, and she never intentionally hurts anybody, but that's just her instinct. That's her breed. Um, but as you can see, she's a really well-behaved dog. Um, she calms down. She would probably do really well, um, you know, as an exercise partner. And then, if you know, you're just laying at your feet at the end of the day, kind of just relaxing. Um, she's a good girl. She, like I said, if you know anything about the breed, has a little bit of a higher anxiety level. And so a place like the shelter um, isn't the best place for karma because it, um, it makes her really kind of anxious. And so when you come to see her, realize that because she doesn't show well in her cage. Um, she'll jump at the door a little bit, maybe do a little bit of barking, some heavy panting. And it's just because um, a place like this really worries her. It gets her a little bit upset. Um, and that's very typical of highly intelligent dogs. You know, they're constantly assessing the situation, um, thinking about things. And so she's just, she's just upset. She doesn't like the kennel. And, I can't blame her. <laughs> not that we're not a great place. <laughs> but anyway, so, you know, Karma is very deserving of a wonderful home. The family that had her before adopted her from here, they really, really loved her. The woman was very upset to give her up. Um, she recently had a baby, and Karma, like I said, just um, those instincts are there. She's she's a good border collie, <laughs> and she's good at her yeah. job, and so she wants yeah. to hurt things, and she was hurting the baby, and it just wasn't um, a good match, and so now we need to find a better match. And um, you know, she walks great on a leash. You know, if you just want to go for leisurely walks, she would be fine with that. Um, and so, I don't know. Uh, she's already spayed, up to date on her shots, and a really pretty dog. So if you're interested in this dog, why don't you come on and meet Karma? The staff will be happy to answer any questions about the breed or about Karma specifically.